gentlemen, welcome to Fight Club. Fight! Fight! All right, coming up next, a matchup for the UFC heavyweight division title. Well, for a long time, he's been mentioned with the baddest man on the planet. For a long time, though, the title fight eluded him. Not anymore. Here he is, the number one heavyweight contender, finally making this walk and cracking a smile. He's waited a long time for this. He's not expecting a 25-minute war. He believes he has the power and the skills to get this thing done quickly. I guess we'll find out. Well, a lot of people think it's the most significant title in combat sports. No argument from me. Baddest man on the planet, UFC heavyweight champion. There he is in the flesh. What an absolute monster. What a title reign it has been. But a serious challenge in front of him here tonight. When this man became the heavyweight champion, a lot of people thought that this challenger was the one who would wrest the belt away. Now the fight is here. We'll see if we get a new champion or if this man continues one of the greatest heavyweight legacies the Octagon has ever seen. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. So a more than five-year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, with some differences in height and a similar reach. And once again, here is the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Bell Center in Montreal, Quebec, Canada. <laughs> Championship of the world. If he was the first. Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 147 pounds. Fighting out of Olympia, Washington, presenting the challenger, Snape. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting at Los Angeles, California. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Bruce the Dragon Lee. All right, this is for the championship. You can give me your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. They touch him up and we are underway. Ready. Ready to fight? All right, so lofty expectations for this matchup as round one gets underway. It seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but on the other, truly a fighter who can do it all. And that guy will usually have the advantage on paper. When you're a striker at this guy's level, that will normally balance out whatever advantage the other guy has. Good series of kicks by him there, DC. He certainly has that part of his game going tonight. He's a fantastic kickboxer, but tonight is the kicks that lead the dance. Nice leg kick. Nice loop and punch. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick 
there. Nice kick landed by the jump. Big kick land. Oh, spinning back fist. He didn't telegraph that one at all. Slips. All right, so we have got a full-on brawl to start this fight. Any concern that these guys might burn themselves out? Oh, they're going to exhaust themselves. So we may as well enjoy it right now because come the third round, regardless of the weight class, they're going to look like two tired heavyweights in the middle of the octagon. Just unable to quite find that range. You wonder if the offensive fighter is going to start to get frustrated here. Most stiffed on all these shots are getting blocked. They're getting blocked because he's fighting one of the best defensive fighters in the UFC. Beautiful leg kick throw. That one's not him. Nice strike. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC. Connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. Lee gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Not only will this affect his ability to stand, but he can't really set down on his punches and he won't generate the power that he normally generates because he can't really get heavy on his leg. A big powerful punch land. Now he gets back in range. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Oh! Just over two minutes to go in what has been a furious round one. Nice punch there by Lee. Throwing haymakers out of the exchange. And he landed the right hand there. Beautiful kick. I mean, the hand speed just absurd. Back to the left hand now, unable to connect. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Now oh, that one should leave a mark. Outstanding leg kick employed there by Lee. He's looking to land the right, just out of range. Combination. That's a big strike right there. Just misses with the right hook. Nice job of hiding that head kick. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes up. Oh, nice job by him to get the knee to the target there, using his length exceptionally well tonight. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, and that lands yet another flush knee. That's going to leave a mark. And again, when you're using this length as effectively as he is here tonight, we might get a finish here in the not-too-distant future. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Okay. No problem. Right, what around it was a lot of high-level knee striking there. Take us through the replays, if you would. Just finding his spots, taking advantage of every opportunity presented to him. Not really having an idea of what he wants to do, just kind of flowing. And what showed itself was those knees, so he took them every time. All right, here we go with round two. Round one, pretty good, not great, but some action on both sides. We can't always hope for fireworks, John. Yeah. Sometimes you've got to deal with the ebbs and flows of the fight. In round number one, you saw both guys have success. Let's see who really charges out ahead in the second round. 
Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand, jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit, finish him off with the uppercut, that is your soda. I mean, come on, man, let this guy have the whole thing. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it was going high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Liver kick. Lee going for the body kick there, but he misses. No setup whatsoever there. Trying to inflict some damage here, but misses with the kick. And they separate. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Three minutes and change to go in round two. I mean, he's cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Big punch lands for the middle. Head kick. Oh! Oh, body kick attempt here, it's no good. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in this second round. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such a to be on his feet right now. Just out of range with that strike. And now he engages in a Muay Thai clinch, and I think a lot of people watching wonder how you can control an opponent like that. Hard to get out of. It's very difficult to get out of. Look and notice how tight his elbows are as he's maneuvering and moving his opponent into positions where he can get off the strikes. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that punch. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Beautiful body kick. Nice head kick. Just misses there with the left. Oh, combination lands. You want to talk about putting strikes together. Beautiful execution. There. And every one of them are landing. He's overwhelming him with different attacks. Ooh, what a head kick. Man, striking class is in session. Beautiful punch there. Great job landing. What a damaging punch. Well, eventually you know he's going to turn this defense into offense, but he's certainly doing a nice job on the defensive end. They talk about the feeling out process, getting his opponent's timing. Now he's blocking everything. Expect counters as we go forward. Nice kick. Nice. Leg kick. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes in this round. Really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. You certainly have to be mindful that you don't gas out, but you gotta like the output on display here. You gotta check these low leg kicks. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. In the books. And it could very well be anyone's fight here. 
All right, so there's the end of the round, and the tide has officially turned. A huge head strike to stun his opponent. We'll see which corner can adjust here moving forward. I mean, they've got to be celebrating. They've got to be happy. Everything's working. But the other side has to be concerned. They have to figure something out, make some sort of adjustment to try to change the tide of this fight. Had him hurt, almost finished. Look at him on the stool. He's still wobbling. This round, I want you to put the pressure on. Get right in his face. All right, so back to back entertaining rounds. We'll see how it goes in this round. We'll see which corner sort of maximize those 60 seconds on the stool. This is what happens. Very skilled, very keen on the match fighters coming together. Nobody has really taken a lead in this fight. Let's see who does it going into the next one. Went for the inside leg kick. Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Turns his hip into that leg kick. Oh, thought he might have had that head kick, but just out of range. And there comes the separation now. Big kick land. The left punch is true, now the right hand. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Oh, big punch land. Straight right, he misses. Oh, man, that couldn't have felt good. Flush knee lands to the body by the taller fight. Oh, another strike to the body. Not a lot of real estate there, but he found it. Now he lands the knee. I'm not sure his opponent saw that coming. He didn't see it coming because he does such a great job of just throwing it. He doesn't have any tell when he's going to throw a knee. Well, you got to think he's happy with this performance here tonight. Essentially, just the way he drew it up, it's been a striking clip. It's like a fairy tale. He's doing everything he wanted to do, and his opponent isn't doing much. Oh! Oh! Right there as he lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. in the night. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting him up now. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. This is a great fight. Oh, he might be out. Now they're both throwing with power. Oh, straight right. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Look at a warrior at trying to shut the liver down. Nice punch land. Back to the leg kick now, that one's no good. Beautiful body kick lands right under the elbow. Big power shot there. Be what a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when his opponent thought he was going low. And now he's got a hurt very bad. Powerful leg kick land. Oh, and he tags him with the straight hand there. Beautifully done by Lee. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Well, they've made all the right reads here tonight, and there's another one. Beautiful read on the leg strike as he catches it and then returns fire with a punch of his own. So they have got the timing down here at this point of the fight. Can't take many of those. You better check. Beautiful wide kick. Lands flush with that right hand. Lee's got a bruise now starting to appear on the right side of his body. Some fighters shy away from checking a leg kick. Check that one. Single collar tie now. It's such a fast leg kick. He missed with that jab attempt there. 
Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. Cable inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. 15 seconds remain in the round. Nice kick. Oh, beautiful combination of kicks. That's three rounds. We're now headed to the championship round. All right, so there's the end of the round. The cut on his lip is only getting worse. We've kept an eye on it tonight. The cut man is gonna have to do some work here to try to prevent that from becoming more of a factor here in this next round. All right, there's the end of the round. So it was a huge strike to the head that stunned his opponent and, and nearly got him out of it. Yeah, that was a big moment. A big strike lands, his opponent's on wobbly legs. That is exactly what, what you want to see as you're walking back to your stool. Your opponent staggering back to his corner and being hopeful that he can get it back together before the start of the next round. All right, here is round four, fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. It almost looked like he went limp there for a second. Bunches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Body kick is blocked. Big leg kick land. Straight punch land. Right under the elbow, the body keeps land. Right punches there. Man, he's just got a great feel for the striking realm early in this one. The timing is on point. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. Connects now with the one-two. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Big head kick. Effective strike there by Lee. Wow, that right punch has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw the strike until he makes it. Stop throwing. Sneaky head kick. Lands the right hand. Big kick lands. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Well, he is at his kickboxing best tonight. Another nice, good series of kicks by him there. I mean, the kicks are coming in bunches. Normally, it's the hands. Tonight, he's throwing kick after kick after kick. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. He lands a switch knee. Lands a big elbow there. Try to establish that jab. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Ooh, looking to set up that head kick. Great punch landing with so much power. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Big head kick. Well, that kick landed the body beautifully placed right underneath that elbow. Let's see if he makes the adjustments now defensively to avoid opening up that midsection to further damage by that kick. Big head kick lands. Back and forth we go here. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Oh, that'll... Officially rock. A big, massive hook that really has put his opponent on skates. Well, at this point of the fight, he is way up on the judges' scorecards, and from a stamina standpoint, he looks like he can fight on the line. He does a fantastic job of fighting at a great pace, 
but also knowing exactly where to preserve and to conserve the energy. And it's showing when you look at his gas tank, and it seems as though it's still full. Oh, that's a beautiful kick right there. I don't know if you've ever been kicked by a mule. It'll probably feel something like that. It has to. This guy has landed his kick with so much force. Nice punch land over the top. Thunderous leg kick rounds his opponent and tried to stay upright, but man, that changed the complexion of this one. Johnny's hurt. He's hurt really badly by that one big leg kick. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. There's no tell on that leg kick. So a huge round for him there. That head kick probably would have had me out for good. The guy survives to see another round. Yeah, but he'll go back to that. It landed so perfectly. He set it up great. He did a great job of mixing up the target early, going up high, and getting the desired result. Nicely done, DC. You can really control a fight just knowing how to fight behind your jab. Well, body language is a great indicator, and that is one confident man right there after a big knockdown in the previous round. He did everything right to secure that knockdown. Perfect setup with the hands. He got the knockdown. Let's see if he can go find the shot that's going to finish the fight. This big kick. Oh, beautiful kick to the body there, and he just left himself wide open for that. And now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it. He was coming high, and now he's got a first bat. Big punch land. Ooh. Nice body. Kick. Oh, that's a good right hand. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. Big body kick. Strike attempt there is blocked. What a body kick. Oh, that's a nice strike. Back and forth we go. Big leg kick land. And they separate.
strike. Looks like he's got a couple hooks in here, DC, and defensively, you better be careful. Crazy accuracy and efficiency with these ground and pound strikes here, and if you're the opponent, you got to intelligently defend or the referee's going to stop him. you got to defend, but you can see him now starting to gain posture, and the intensity at which he's throwing these ground strikes is starting to improve. It's starting to elevate because he knows that he can get the finish. Back to his patented kicks here, but just out of range. Would you look at the size of that bruise on his torso? Nasty. All right, late in the fight now, he needs a finish, or he's going to lose this fight tonight. We'll see if he goes for it. I mean, he's got to pull out all the stops. There is no more strategy. There is no more time to try to set up a punch. You got to just start letting everything fly. Well, looks as though his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. 30 seconds to go here. How good is that right hand? All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. And maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got to hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Oh, nice high kick. All right, so there it is, the final horn, a lifetime of work, all building to this moment, and the underdog challenger comes up large with his striking game tonight. He's gonna be the new champ. I mean, he came up big in a massive spot. He was the underdog. He wasn't supposed to get this done. He relied on what got him here, the striking, to take the title from the long-reigning champion. decision is in. Bruce Buffer has it. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score the contest 50-45, 49-46, and 49-46. For the winner, by unanimous decision, and new undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, so how about this? We have a new UFC heavyweight champion of the world. I think that guy beats Daniel Cormier. I, I mean, this guy beats anybody. I'm telling you, right now, he is the king of the world for a reason. The number one heavyweight in the world, a guy that possesses knockout.